you want to survive the Walker Onslaught, you'll need a bit of training. First, let's take a look at your controls. How do you want to turn? Try each option and see what's comfortable for you. Give turning a try. How do you want to move around? Try each style. They're all pretty different. Try moving around. Looking good. Now move towards the door. You can bash doors and other objects in the environment. Uh-oh, here comes a walker. You can shove walkers to get some space. Try it now. Good. You can also grab walkers in a choke to hold them in place. Now throw the walker away from you to make space. Only one way to keep him down for good. Choke the walker and stab it in the head. Don't kill the walker until you choke it. <coughs> Fighting isn't the only way to survive. Time to learn about scavenging. If you see any useful materials out there, be sure to take them with you. Now that you have everything, let's focus on the locked door. Locks can be broken by bashing them with any weapon. Keep moving. Sometimes you can find materials inside containers. Bash the container to open it. Bring back all the food you can find so our community can grow. If a container is on the ground, you'll kick it open if you bump into it. Some items are rarer than others and can be used to upgrade weapons. Let's see what that hammer can do to a walker. Try it on this one. Of course, there are ways to kill walkers without getting too close. Let's test your aim. Try grabbing that pistol. Some weapons can be stabilized with your offhand. Steady the pistol and take a shot at those walkers. When you want to reload, eject the magazine and grab a new one from your hip using your offhand. You can aim down the sights of your gun for more accuracy. Keep shooting the walkers in the range. Nice shooting. Why don't you try this one out? This lever action shotgun packs a punch. Use both hands to keep it stable. Lever action guns need to be cycled each shot. Quickly flick the gun to cycle. Make sure to reload. There's more ammo on the table. Carry four weapons at once on your weapon wheel. Release the button on the weapon you would like to switch to. If you pick up another weapon, you'll swap it for whatever you're holding. Pick up this machete. Perfect. It's best to keep a balance of firearms and melee weapons at all times. Time for a live test. Don't move. A walker's gonna break through that door. 
Remember, you can shove walkers away using your hands or any weapon. Shove it with your off hand first. You need to shove it with your empty hand. Shove the walker, you good. Now try it with your weapon. Now move forward and finish it off. Clear. Head through where the walker came in. Kill that walker before it's too late. Watch your back out there. If a walker grabs you, it'll pin you down. Welcome to the new world. Damn it. The hell was Daryl thinking coming out here by himself? Well, just remember, protocol dictates that things are gonna heat up real fast out there. No kidding. Be ready to meet at the fallback spot. I will await your signal and arrange your rendezvous when mission success has been achieved. Definitely Daryl. Yeah, it looks like him. Daryl, you better have a damn good reason for running off. saying you wouldn't come with don't mean I can't do it myself I told you not to go don't answer to you Rick I have people to protect that includes you there's a life at stake do you even care that isn't what I'm maximum walkers coming this way I want to hunker down drive to the fallback spot Eugene we can settle this later here Take this. Van's moving to the East Road. Let's go. Yeah, I know the way. Watch it! <laughs> Shit! I'll be fine. Take the path to your left. I'll see you at the van. Daryl! Daryl! to get to the van fast.
Far now. Finally, let's get out of here. Your leg. Just a little banged up from the bridge. I'll be fine. Doesn't look fine to me. Can we go already? Eugene, get that engine running. You still owe me a talk. That leg isn't gonna heal anytime soon. Hope it was worth it. Won't take too long. Feels better than it looks. <sighs> Rick, we got a line on those supplies. You ready to go? Stay here. We'll talk when I get back. Michonne, I'm on my way. Hey, now that the war's over, we can finally focus on rebuilding Alexandria. Glad you're here to help. You finished those plans then? Yeah. We're organizing efforts to scavenge food and materials. With enough food, we can bring in new survivors. With enough materials, we can build out the community and the arsenal. If you want to go out there, use the map. Sounds good. The first thing to do is pick where you want to go. Options are limited for now, but... Once we recruit more survivors, we'll be able to search farther out. Once you select a site, check out all the info the scouts gathered on it, like what materials can be found there. I think I'm ready. You still need to gear up. Head over to the armory while I get things prepped. May not seem like much now, but as you discover weapons, the armory will grow. Take a look at what we've got. and a knife for you in the armory. Make sure to get them both.
pistol and a knife for you in the armory. Make sure to get them both. Saw Daryl earlier. He said to swing by when you have a minute. You finally ready to talk? told you not to go out. Why didn't you listen? She's still out there. Who? The girl. I told you. Just need another day. I can find her. You came back in a cop car, covered in blood. I asked you to tell me what happened, and instead you ran off. What's going on with you? I need you to trust me. No, Daryl. I'm trying to rebuild after a war. And I need everybody here, now. Ah, oh, fine. You really want to know what happened out there? Started with the herd. The one that ran me off the road. Shit. <laughs> First thing I heard was Eugene on the radio. Anybody there? I heard one hell of a cacophonous crash. Everything hunky dunky on your end? Next, I heard the walkers. I needed a weapon. Fast. Can you hear me? I believe your vehicle may have been compromised. If you can hear me, find some form of vehicular transportation. I found them just in time. Where'd you end up? I was in the middle of a camp. Looked destroyed. Any survivors? Nah. I was just hoping for meds. Eventually, I found some meds. It fixed me up, but it wasn't long to rest. The place was crawling. Had to keep moving. Why didn't you tell me any of this before? Didn't have time. Still don't. It took you two days to get back. You don't think I need to know what's going on? Ugh. 
Winchester was turning into the only choice I had. Found a cop car. That's when you drove home. Wasn't that easy. The gun on the hood helped, though. Right in time, too. My arms were getting tired. The place was shit housed. People must have panicked. The military had put up some kind of a barricade. They were probably trying to keep things under control. If you say so. Had to get ready before the barricade came down. The only choice was to fight. Got through, barely, and I headed toward town. 